I'm Rich and this is Terry. And welcome to our channel Wagger Slides. Um, we've been gate guarding for um, about oh about four to five weeks now yeah. in uh, South Texas, a little bit of east uh, east southeast of uh, San Antonio, um, and uh, it's been a pretty good experience. Um, and uh, we've actually learned quite a bit and kind of filled in the gaps of a lot of the other channels that we. Uh, watching and I think what we're going to do is do kind of a series of uh, videos that um, kind of uh, talk about some aspects that some other people haven't really talked about. Um, we have a um, six-year-old German short hair pointer, a larger dog that we have with us here. Um, you know, we're actually at a drill site, so we get the experience here at a drill site. Um, and we're just finishing it off. The, the site's just cleaning up now. There'll be probably uh, transporting the rig out of here in the next two or three days uh -huh. and then after that we move on to our next adventure yeah on it so on it um, and you know it's some things that were a little different than we kind of expected um, some things that um, I think that uh, we got a lot of good information from a lot of good different channels um, RV SWAT was one of them yeah. um, um, I'm trying to think of a few other ones here but that's one that comes to mind I'll put some links down <laughs> below um, or maybe up above someplace here too of some of the other channels that we had followed and learned a little bit about too so because we got a lot of good information from them and really appreciated um, the work that they did together but there's a few things we'd like to do to kind of talk about a pet at the you know having pets at the gate um, doing um, you know just talking about having an RV um, we actually have a truck travel trailer a 28 foot uh, Lance travel trailer and we have a, uh, a Dodge a 1500 four wheel drive truck um, as well so so we'll talk a little bit about that and uh, a little different experience than just having a straight up uh, you know, RV uh, so but I think initially it's really you know the big thing is I think it's uh, probably the boredom was initially yeah. it was one big thing trying to get you know used to not uh, having a lot of downtime because um, yeah. it goes up in ways it's sometimes it's really busy yeah. sometimes it's really slow and it kind of goes up and down on it and the other thing too was probably just getting into a schedule yeah. that made sense because we were really exhausted the first week and uh, in fact i'm supposed to be in my bedtime right that's now that's right and so uh so apologize for the dark and circles I'm on in the duty. Eye. and she's on duty so uh you know, on it, so on it. Uh, but anyway, uh, but we just wanted to kind of touch bit, touch base, and let everybody know kind of where we are and what we're doing. Um, we're gonna start putting together a series of videos, very specifically the things that have happened to us. Um, I got a lot of video I've taken over the last uh, month and a half or so, and um, which is gonna fill in some of the gaps. So we'll probably start a new series about gate guarding, and then also try to get back to just. Uh, Probably doing our vlog. We try to do a daily vlog. I think it's probably going to be once a week yeah. at this point. Um, you know, just kind of give an update, uh, uh, kind of what's happening. That's probably not related to the gate so much, um, and uh, you know, um, and go from there. So, but anyway, um, that's about it. Yeah, just a quick update. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, surprisingly enough, the bells haven't gone off, which is uh, amazing. Amazing because usually <laughs> they do because it's been really busy all morning here because uh, they're getting ready. They're already starting to disassemble parts of the yeah. rig on it, so they don't Some fool big around. Big stuff going out. Right on it. So I think they're finishing up the casement today, and then I think tomorrow they'll take out the small stuff. I think Monday they're um, they'll probably drop the rig sometime tomorrow, um, and then disassemble it um, and start shipping it out on Monday. So on it and it's moving about five miles on the road i'm not too sure if we're going to follow it or not hopefully we do yeah, I know. um you know we kind of know a lot of the guys now and uh guys and girls um and uh you know so hopefully uh we'll um uh um uh, be able to get some uh, good you know uh give you guys share some of our experiences and some of the things that we would probably do a little differently some yeah. of the things that we bought that we actually upgraded to make our lives a little bit easier mm -hmm. um you know how do you get through a night um when it's boring as heck but you still have to be up without yeah. falling asleep and uh how to survive the bugs how to survive yeah the the creatures i would say i won't say the bugs creepy the, crawlers. The, the, the tv crew yeah, on it and yeah. stuff things that we found that work mm. and uh you know on it um you know just basically getting the rig into some of these rough roads we're going to talk about that a little bit yeah and um and even just you know hooking up and and how to use the uh uh the trailer that, that that's right out the back here that has the generator and and our sewer and everything else associated with it and how that all works you know, on it. and um some things that we like to upgrade going forward so yeah but anyway uh that's about it yeah so we'll catch you in the next one in the next video yeah. yep 
And if you like what you saw, please subscribe. Give us a big thumbs up. That's right. And hit, hit the bell. Hit the bell. So uh, you'll know when uh, we post again. So yep. on it. And uh, we'll uh, all be seeing you around. Until then, take care. Yep. Bye. Bye.